Okay, is it working? All right. <laughs> I'm not in the dark. I do this stream in the middle of the day. I'm so sorry. Okay, where the hell was I in here? Um, I think I had at least gone through four. Do I have to go this way? I have to go through the, uh, through the room with all the doors again, right? <coughs> Allergies are getting me today. It, it froze? It froze, hold on. My whole laptop is having trouble today. Does it need to update again? What's wrong? Okay, we went through. Okay. where that brought me. Every time it brings me back to this room, I'm gonna go back through the door I came from and then move over to the next one. That's gonna be my process. I don't know if I can go through the doors uh, when it's red. I'm just trying to be careful. Also looking at something else on the side, trying to answer the message. I swear I don't get a moment of peace. Oh. Okay, now I'm next to it. my god dang head. Wait, so I went through... went through that one and came right back out, right? Okay. Currently, I don't know which door to go through, because there's, like, a ton of them, so... Uh, this is one of a series of 11 games, only six of which are out so far. They all share some kind of theme that I don't understand yet. Uh, in this game, every time that creepy thing on the left turns its head around and the screen goes red, you can't move or it'll get you. Currently I'm in a room with quite a lot of doors and I'm trying to figure out which door it is. I'm doing it very slowly because, like, the only methodical way I can think of. Going into and out of each door while I have time while trying to find the door that doesn't take me back to this room. Now, unfortunately, I'm very slow. And if it gets me, I'll have to start this area all over again. I can't entirely remember which door I've been to, so I just feel like kinda gotta... <coughs> I don't know 
Oh, going through the doors counts as a movement. But get a chiropractor or like put a hot compress on your neck. The crunchy sounds is its neck turning around. It needs a massage or something. Bruh, do some stretches. It sounds painful, dude. The thing is, I don't even know if I'm going, like, I'm pretty sure I'm just trying to find another room. Ah, the game froze again. I see why it must be mad. It's, it's got a really, really stiff neck. It's got neck pains. That'll make anyone pissed off. Okay, it didn't... It didn't come get me, so I think moving through the doors is like a free movement that doesn't count. And there's like a bunch of these things. Okay, I'm down here again. The game involves a lot of going through doors, and trying to avoid getting caught by the thing, by only moving when it's green. I don't know where I just went. Did I go to, like, to the next door? Apparently not, okay. Yep. Not really, it's more like suspenseful. There are like a lot of little puzzles to figure out. It's definitely not everyone's kind of game, I mean. It's very different to the other games in the series so far. Oh, fucking. Lost track of what I was doing. Heck off, heck off. Go away. Okay, maybe, hold on. Maybe I can try that upper door again. No, wait, it wasn't here. Touching it doesn't do anything. You can touch the monster while it's turned around, and it won't do anything. Is this door still locked? That door is still locked. <coughs> there are these little notes left around, and sometimes they have important information on them. Sometimes they're just little notes. This is this one area where I don't entirely know uh, what to do with it. But there is one of these things up here and I have to follow it. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, it's called, um, on. One, two, three, four, five. There's a, uh, in each of these games in this series, one, two, three, four, five. There's three shapes that you have to find, and you have to do special things to make them happen. Um, people in the community are trying to find... One, two, three, four, five. Trying to find all the shapes, because when you find the shapes in the previous game, he'll unlock the next game. So far, only six of the games, one, two, three, four, five, six, have been unlocked, and the seventh one is coming out next month, I think? But there are supposed to be 11 games. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I try to count my steps to make sure I don't run into it. I've tried this area before. 1. Game, stop freezing. I guess it's kind of ARG-ish, yeah. Like, it, uh... In the game. I don't... I can't remember if Found Horror Game 11... It's called Found Horror Game 11.exe. That's the whole title of it. Also, it keeps freezing today because my laptop is is having a hard time, I guess. Maybe I should turn off my captioner? But like, yeah, uh, this is the fourth game called Red Light, Green Light. Uh, so I played the other games. The first one, um, I can't remember what it is, but it takes place at a gas station. And then the second one is actually the intro to another horror game that the dev is working on game. Come on, are you okay? 
Ah, it froze again. It froze again in this spot. This is the spot. Don't, don't freaking full screen it. This is the spot where it froze before and then it crashed. Heck, okay, come on. Is it back? There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm still behind you, buddy. Lead on. Lead the way. Go on. One, two, three, four, five, five. Okay, it went through the door, and then I got followed up again. And it keeps leading me through, like, weirder hallways. Yeah, go ahead. I'm gonna be slowly working through this. One, two, three, four, five. Five. Go enjoy doing whatever you're doing today or tonight. Yeah, it's tonight where you are. One, two, three, four, 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 four. I'll get through this eventually. Oh, spooky music. Doing seven at a time on this one. <coughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Caught me there. Okay, it ran ahead through the door. It's so excited when it rushes through the door. It's like, woohoo, hee hee hee. Follow me through here. Won't we have such fun? Yeah, buddy, keep going, go on. I'm just hitting this little switch so I can keep following you, pal. I'm coming, I'm coming. Yep, yep, I'm, yep, I'm here, I'm moving around the boxes. There's a lot of boxes here for some reason. Okay, this is the area I got stuck on before. Because the game crashed, I think. Oh, that already messed up. Why do you get to hop through the barricade? Mm. Go on. Yep, I, I gotta get the other switch. turning your head the other way now and then? I mean, maybe that's- maybe you need to turn it the other way now and then? Do- do some stretches, do some yoga, go into a hot sauna for a while, get a surgery? 
Like, something's wrong there, buddy. Oh, there's no door. Oh wait, there's a corner. Duh. Okay. Couldn't see from the glare on my screen. Alright, turn the brightness up a little bit. What is in this little door? Who the fuck are you? Hmm, I'm gonna have to dodge it. Hold on, what's down this other door? door has been unlocked. Which door is this? Oh, it's this door. Cool. Alright. Now I can go back up through door one to get to this area if I have to start over. Alrighty. Alright, gotta wait. Hmm. What did the ghost? Hey there, pal. I caught up with you. I just had to go and lock a door real quick. Now watch out, I'm gonna catch you. Hopefully. Ah! Dang it, I got the... I try to push F8. It doesn't do anything. Fuck. Okay, I gotta restart it. Hold on. Steam, please? Steam, are you okay? Stim. <sighs> Game 4, red light, green light. Oh, I probably should have just pressed F5, huh? <laughs> I could have just pressed F5. Okay. Mm hmm. Okay. The last one I unlocked comes out through here. I mean, through there. Where does six go? This one's also still locked, right? Yeah. Yeah, this goes up through here. there. Okay. Mm -hmm. about eight now. Just trying to be careful. Mm-hmm. Yep, I did that. I I opened the barricade, yep. Now here I come. to avoid. Ah! Ugh, oh, okay. Really got that one. Great.
place is full of a lot of ghosts. No! Come on. Is that supposed to be in the game? Is that supposed to happen? I feel like maybe that's supposed to happen, just to mess with me. I feel like it's supposed to happen. Because it lets me get a little bit further each time. Hmm. For now, I'm going to go back over here. Check another message. <laughs> I do hope that whatever that thing is that's happening in the other area where it keeps having problems, I hope that's actually part of the game. I think I'd be more okay with it if that was actually part of the game. Maybe it's like somewhere in the middle. Wait, did I go through that one? Oh, it just led me somewhere else. I think it led me to the door right next to it. I don't even know this is what I'm supposed to be doing, but, you know, just in case, I might as well. Maybe I have to go through a certain sequence of the doors? to figure out how to get the sequence right. something else I gotta be doing. Is it is it on top of a door? Do I need to get it to go away from the door and then Oh Did I find it? What's up? I don't really feel up to talking today. I promise. 
I'm sorry, I know I'm not really a good girlfriend. Do you want to break up? I'll be okay. You should do what you want. Huh? Where'd you go? Hey, look, it's okay. I don't know. I'm sorry, I'm really not good at coming up with topics. What do you want to talk about? Um, sure. I, I'm sorry, I'm not that interesting. Why are you the one apologizing? Hmm. Give me some time to think about it. Listen, I need to think on this by myself. I know you want to talk about it together, but... Stop yelling at me. You're the one who wanted us to be together. I warned you. I don't care anymore. Just leave me alone. Hmm. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You keep screwing up. I'm such a bitch to you. I understand if you don't want to deal with me anymore. Girl, you're just depressed. Let's try to work on your problems, huh? Why? Why do you keep trying so hard? I know you care. You really shouldn't care about me. You don't get to tell me who I care about. Or this little avatar I'm playing. He can decide for his damn self. There's things I need to do for myself. I just can't be there when you want me to be. Do I have to tell you every little thing I'm doing? Are you a narcissist? Do you even really care about me at all? Or only if I act in the way that you want me to? I knew I couldn't. Hmm? Sounds like they're both depressed. Oh, dang. There's a heart on the door. Door has been unlocked. Alright, we're back over here. Um, what's in here? Oh, does this go to the, uh... Ah, cool. So this one goes in here, right? Nice. Has, has this one been unlocked yet? Still locked. Maybe it needs to be unlocked from the other side. Um... Door gives you an ominous feeling. Are you sure you're ready? Uh, not yet. Let me go check out the door with the heart on it. Maybe Cootie's in there. Not sure I'd like to see that, but I don't know. Maybe she's in there. Door's locked. A black hole shaped like a heart is engraved into the door. Ah. Okay. Has that other door been opened? Ugh. Hmm. I need to get at it from from this side or from the other direction. I'm wondering if one of the shapes is in that door. It's already been found by the community, but like still I'm wondering what's in that door. I think this goes out to one, so that should let me go back to six, right? up to that area. Hmm. Oh, right, this spot. The door was locked behind me. Went the wrong heckin' way. Oh yeah, this is the one where uh, the key magically appeared over there. on that door still kind of weirds me out. Let's try going back up through this area and seeing if I can 
do it this time. If I get another error message, which I think is part of the game. Mm hmm. March, 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 march. Marching along. Pressing the wrong freaking button. All right. Ah! How dare you? Did it actually? Is it actually in the game? I can't tell. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I get it. Yeah. Keep going. Yeah, there's that. Ah, oh, dang. I hope whatever you're getting checked out, uh, turns out okay. Or maybe it's just a routine thing, I don't know. I'm gonna try this area again. If I get the thing again, I may just go to the other area. I try to press F8 and nothing happens, so... Yeah, no, connection at, uh... Medical offices is always kind of trash. is like the most I can do it seems. One, two, three, four, five, four, 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 four. Uh, this one again. Game. Get. Game. No. I did the thing again. Okay. Fine. Yes, yes, yes. One more time with this before I get frustrated. Mm -hmm. Uh, 
Haha, -ha. okay. Go ahead. Move along. Nothing to see here. What were you hoping to see me move? I ain't moving at all. You're imagining things. Happened again, okay. I'm gonna have to look that up to see if it's an actual glitch in the game or if it's supposed to happen. Okay, and there we go. Let's go into the worrying room. This concerning place. There it gives you an ominous feeling. Sure, let's go. Okay, can't examine these. This is like the only game so far where I haven't been able to examine every tiny little thing. What is up with the cardboard boxes in these games? The screen doesn't seem to be green or red, so... We're going into darkness again. Uh -huh. I need you. I always needed you. You never saw just how interesting you actually were. I couldn't get enough of you. I hated you always self-destructing, always isolating yourself, stuck in place, unable to grow. What is that? I always had good intuition. I saw the I saw past the shell you put up for yourself. They say it's what's on the inside that counts. Well, that's loud. And trust your savior. Your insides are beautiful. Oh dear. What even was that? Ex excuse me. Is there gonna be a credit in here for the music? Because I, I really like the music. All these artists. You never knew me one day. Oh, baby, please admit it. It's your imagination. This ain't no realization. Happy teachings put around your head. The man you knew is gone and dead. The pure field. One of two. I guess that something else might have happened if I managed to get through that upper area. Mm -hmm. Oh, it closed itself. Okay. Well, all right then. On to game five, the pure field. Okay, trying to get that to open up. Doing 
some little stretches. Okay, I think the game is trying to open. There we go. Okay, game capture. Feast your eyes. Little marshmallow. Ah, what did I click? Before playing as a horror game, don't rob yourself the experience. Play in a dark and quiet environment wearing head well, I had the headphones on. So far the sound effects in those games have been really good actually, and the music. You may switch between full screen and windowed by pressing F4. You may also click and drag the sides of the screen to resize the screen in windowed mode. Yep. While you may turn down the music and sound effects from the config menu on the title screen, I suggest keeping them on as they're useful in gameplay. Ugh. The game has adult content and a dark and disturbing nature, dealing with several themes that may not be suitable for all audiences. If you're prone to sensitivity, cherish that, and maybe don't play this game. You've been warned. Okay. These games all have, like, the exact same controls, which is helpful. Okay, it's a couch. Oh, my dear sweet little marshmallow. How I missed you. I recall the many memories we've shared. Your efforts to rescue me with the utmost, uttermost bliss. You're my beloved knight, you know? My beautiful shining prince, as precious as the glow of a baby star. But it has been a while since we last saw each other, huh? Perhaps you've forgotten me. But do not fear, for I will hold out for you, my dear. But now is not the time for idle memories, for at this very moment you're sinking. Are you still unable to see, even now? If so, then this is quite a predicament. Little Marshmallow, if you don't, start di don't stop diving deeper, well, who knows what might happen to you? Or just who just might take an interest? Who might just take an interest? Like a moth to the flame. But oh, how excited this makes me feel! It's absolutely mesmerizing, drawing out an even more curious side of myself, which makes me want to explore you all over. However, I do remember how you've helped me in the past, and so I shall hold my tongue. Bite down into it. Chew it up, tear it apart until it bleeds, and spit it out. We may share in these revels later, but for now you must stop sinking. Or maybe it is your intention to sink. What the fuck does that all mean? <laughs> a little ominous? A little creepy? What is the significance of the red couch? Oh no, the game froze. Mm -hmm. Give it a second. Okay, there we go. Streamlabs okay? Okay. They say time waits for no one. But what do you do if time's already stopped for you? Ah! Oh. Hello! No, oh, hoo hoo hoo! I can't go back, not anymore. Okay, look at that rock. Oh, look how cute this thing is. This is a cute little squishy, low poly little traveler. Bouncing along with the creepy red little eyes. Aww. Oh, walking through the sands with my cute little hat and robe. Oh, some big mysterious doors. What happens if I go over here? Can I go there? Okay. Oh boy, did she go in? I am a murderer. Okay then, not that long ago I was sentenced to death row. I was to be hanged for my crimes. Your crime of murder? I stabbed eight people to death. Oh damn. But somehow I escaped that fate. My noose broke at the last crucial moment. I ran, but... 
I never really became free, you know? The only way I can go now is forward. Okay, interesting exposition there. Who were those eight people you stabbed and why? Time and place are beginning to blur. I guess that's all right. I have nowhere to go and nothing to look forward to. Oh, -hoo -hoo. what is this? It is a weed. Frankly, I'm sick of these things. There's some giant cement pipes resting here. Not quite what I was expecting. Is there construction going on here? Maybe there is construction. Bump, 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 bump. Oh. Bump, 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 bump. Just squishing my way down the stairs. No, oh, it's similar to the other save things. Even without natural light, these things can grow. The weed is growing out of the cement. It's quite resilient. Save game. It's similar to the, uh, the other game save system. Oh, what is this? Stare into the pit. Okay, I guess there's nowhere else to go. Let's hop on in. Get burned by the steam that's coming out of it. Or maybe breathe in all that smoke and die. Hello, did we die? Are we dead now? Is this the afterlife? Ah, cute little pixel fire is! Squishing my way along. What was that? What was that? There was something big there. I'll get away from that, maybe. It seemed to go forward and backward quite slowly, but sideways very quickly. Another furniture item. Huh? So it didn't work, huh? I knew this was just a load of hogwash. J just give it a second, okay? It's gonna work. It has to work. Joan, none of us here want to see this fail, but Harry is right. We waited long enough. All of our hard work was for nothing. We should just go home. So you're just gonna leave Valerie? We're gonna let her die? Um, I'm sorry, Joan, but I'm with Harry and Ben on this one, too. We all knew this probably wouldn't work. We've done all we could, I think. We just have to- Don't give me any of that bullcrap, Allie. You never even liked her to begin with. You're selfish. You know that? You all are just so selfish. You're the one being selfish, Joan. This was a dumb idea all along. We only helped because none of us wanted to see a classmate disappear without a trace. But this load of crap isn't going to bring her back. You're just like her, really. Living off in your own little fantasy world and pulling others into your own delusional bullcrap- Bullcrap is like one of the most annoying- <laughs> replacement words. I'm so sick of this. If this is how you all feel, then fine. I'm sorry for dragging you into this. I'll just do it all over my myself. Hello, I'm a murderer. What's up? It, it worked! I, I can't believe it. It worked. What? What? Hmm? Uh... A note. Yes, read the note. Joan, Harry, Allie, and Ben are your friends. Take care of them. Um, okay? Hello? This is strange. These appear to be dolls of some sort. I guess this whole scene isn't real, but I could have sworn they were just talking. This is a little unsettling. Uh. Huh. An empty blackboard. A little cabinet. There's nothing too interesting on, though. A podium. Gonna be dolls. Weird. Single chair rests by the table. It's dusty and seems to not have had any use in some time. A single stool is fixated into place. A dusty window. It's impossible to see through. Weren't these big doors up? 
Now I'm outside. Okay. A pot of fake flowers. It doesn't seem like a lot around here is actually real. Where am I exactly? Hmm. Japanese classrooms? A garbage can filled with what you'd probably expect to see within a garbage can. Garbage. A book. There's only one phrase written in the book. Inhaling breath. There's also a switch cut into the book by the phrase. Press it? Not yet. Let's, uh... A-O? Within the cage, you spot a switch. Pressing it does nothing, however, as there seems to be no power supplied to whatever this is. I wonder what it's for. A chalkboard. A-O is written onto it. What is, mo what is most likely chalk? Hmm. School textbooks. Nothing particularly interesting amongst them. There's nothing specially interesting about this cabinet. A rusted over cabinet. A shelf. Nothing very interesting. One phrase written in the book. Giant hills. Zebra's lair. Dinosaur catastrophe. Ashes fall. Bumblebees pollinate flowers. Hazy day. A wondrous occasion. Anytime you want. You got it. Other side of life. Everyone hates a critic. I'm gonna read every single one of these. Splintering words. A glowing waterfall. Curious exchange. A sense omnipresence. Button has been pressed. Book club. Anytime over three minutes. Baby carriage. The sudden surprise. I don't think I want to press the switch mark sudden surprise. The forgotten horizon. I can't remember what that one was, but I was hoping that AO will be ascent omnipresence. Hmm, okay. Which one was ascent omnipresence? Was it this one? Maybe I have to press them in order? Electric socket. I presume it's not working, as this place doesn't appear to have electricity. But I'm not going to risk myself to find out either. I could also try going the other direction. A rickety old chair. Maybe this was used for disobedient students. The door is locked. Okay. Come on, you can do it. Yeah, there we go. Oh. Okay, this is this room. Just sort of showed up here. window peering into one of the classrooms. I find it kind of creepy to have windows peering into a classroom. It's like someone from the outside could be peering in at any moment. But I guess not much of that will be happening here. The windows are so dusty you can't see inside. Oh, hello. A frying pan with an egg, some bacon, and an eyeball. Once upon a time, I was questioned about this piece. I'm not going to question myself about it again. What? How do you know about it? A 
bookshelf, but I don't have the will to read all these books right now. What is what is this? The button? There's a book on the desk. Read it. Read note. The circuits that wind through the walls of this establishment are all connected. To turn off any or one device on the premises, you all you must do is find the correct phrase, press the associated button, and then press either the power switch in this room or the one in the faculty lounge. Hmm. I hope all believers will remember this on their own, but just in case any of you forget, I've decided to write it down here. I wish you all the best as I go to be with one with the Crimson Angel. Okay. Um, I don't want to t think about it. What? I don't, I don't know what's over there. I can't see it. Hmm. Another door? Mm -hmm. There's a note plastered on the wall. Read it. Remember, students, there's nothing wrong with not being okay. If you ever feel a bit sick, or in a little pain, or even just want someone to confide in, I'm here for you. Lauren Howling. Some discarded shoes. I wonder what the store here is. A candle flickers light into the dark clinic. Okay, this is the school nurse. An office desk, probably where a doctor would work, judging by the look of the room. Among the supplies, there's a note that catches your attention. Yes. I've been a bit concerned about the students here as of late. A lot of students have been coming to school sick, and I don't just mean with the common cold, but almost none of them will come and see me about it. The symptoms are a bit strange, and at first glance seem more like a psychological condition rather than a physical one. They'll just start spacing out at a moment's notice, completely cut off from outside stimuli. Some of the students will just start walking as if in a trance and head to wherever the closest access to a view of the outside is. And then they'll just start staring at dirt. They'll stare at it for minutes at a time, just looking down at the dirt. It's very strange and very concerning. It's been happening to dozens of students, but it's hard to get them to come in and see me about it. Most don't seem to think it's anything more than them just spacing out. The school board isn't treating this like an issue either. I think they think it's just a bunch of aloof kids trying to pull a prank on the teachers to get out of class. But if you take a moment to walk down the halls, particularly close to the windows and doors leading to the outside, you'll find several kids just standing there, staring. I don't even know where to begin with this, but something is very obviously wrong. Yeah. A locked cabinet of medical supplies. There's something shiny on top of this cabinet, but it's too high to reach it. Hmm. A dirty bed. It's an absolute mess. A worn out table it looks about ready to collapse. There's a note plastered on the wall. Read it. Do you know those nights where you're laying down and suddenly you feel like you're falling just for a second? Oh yeah, this is the moment when all your muscles relax. What if we're all just falling? What if life is but a fleeting dream in the last moment of existence? We live in the dream, but when we begin to lay to rest and enter within a dream, for that brief moment we experience it when we detach our sense from this plane. And in that single moment when we tread into our subconscious, we feel it. Just for that moment, we feel ourselves falling. Maybe our time here has slowed down to our actual descent, as in maybe we're always deep down, as maybe we always deep down are experiencing falling, but in slow motion to the point we don't regularly realize it. And in those moments, it just catches up with us. For just a splinter of a moment, we're actually in real time. And each and every little time we experience this, we're just a little bit closer to the ground. Well, damn, dude. Cardboard boxes. Some cardboard boxes full of papers. None of them seem important. Hmm, how do I get up there? I am too short. Up here. Locked cabinet. Mm -hmm. Some unused trash bins. The roof has collapsed here, leaving a pile of shredded wood. Frankly, it'd be a pain to trudge through. I'll find another way. How do I... There's a note there! How do I get to the note? What was this room again? Oh yeah. 
I don't know. I don't know what or who this is. It's it's just moving slightly. Hello there. It's an anatomy model. It sure is. Joan, Harry, Ellie, and Ben are your friends. Yeah, what 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 do I do with these kids? They're just they're dolls. I apparently stabbed a bunch of people. Did I get isekai into another reality? A pot of fake flowers. Oh yeah, I remember that. Dusty, dusty windows. This one was the Ascent's Omniscience Room, right? Electricum. Oh. Ah! Well, the whole school shock just then. What happened? Did that, like, rearrange the outside or something? Did it get the, uh, did it get the stuff to go away? The anatomy model disappeared again. I'm just kind of saving a new file every time, I don't even know. It just gives me so many save files. Did the stuff get cleared out? It did not. Maybe I should, um, press this. Yeah, go back over here. Boop, 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 boop. Bouncing along. Is this one right? Oh, a sense omnipresence. Did I, did I find the right one? I don't think I need to mess with this cage any more than I have already. Okay, so I guess I found. Was there um an L H? Slowly slomming my way over. Alright. Okay, the door's still locked. I'm guessing something changed in one of the other rooms. Let's do this one. Okay, so it's the same thing. Oh, they're gone. Lit candle caused a warm glow across the table. Where'd they go? Did they move to another room? Does the note say the same thing? Huh. Uh, let's see where they went. Oh wait, I, I just came through here. Hello, glowing save point. Boop, boop, boop. Mm -hmm. Is anyone in here? Oh, the item fell down. There's a key sitting on the ground. Obtain the school key. Nice. Okay, I guess I can go through that one door now. I should have figured that that would, that would make the thing fall down. Okay. 
Let's go find uh, my friends, I guess. Boop, 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 boop. Save again. Just keep saving. Such a cute little face. I wonder why it slows down so much going in this direction. Hey, unlock the door with the school key. Hello? Hello? What is that? A fan or something? Cages? Oh, they're cages. Little bird cages. I can't comment on any of them. Not a single bird to be seen. I'm moving faster. I'm like running. I'm like running really fast. Oh. Moving diagonally, I move faster than moving forward and back. Eh, 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 eh. Oh. Wait. Okay, yeah, go this way, then over here. Examine that. Oh. Am I supposed to be able to like move the viewer around? It's not letting me. Golly, it sure is dark in here. Oh. Hey. I don't like this, not one bit. Give credit where credit is due. They came just like Joan said they would. I think we should give them both the benefit of the doubt. I mean, this is like a miracle. I don't know, Allie. I kind of agree with Ben on this one. This whole thing is just too weird. And how is this thing even going to help us find Valerie? It doesn't talk, doesn't even really do anything, just stares at us creepily. What can it even do? Don't be like that, Harry, and I think it's kind of cute. Joan just said ha Joan said just having it around would help us find Valerie. I guess all we have to do is look around town and take it with us? Uh, I got a flash flood warning for my area. That's comforting. Uh, what, are we t walking our pet? I'm not taking that thing with me into town. What the fuck? Where the fuck is Joan anyway? Apparently she already took it with her to check out the beach. So she bailed on us. That fucking bra- How old are you? She wants each of us to spend a day searching a part of town with it. I don't like it either, but I guess we should do it. Who knows what might happen? I'll tackle the industrial district tomorrow on Friday. Harry, she wants you to check out some part of town on Saturday. And Joan, she wants you to take them somewhere on Sunday. Saturday? I'm going to a party on Saturday. You can take it with you, Harry. It'll probably make you the life of the party anyways. I have church on Sunday, so I guess I could take that to check out the neck of the woods. Check out that neck of the woods. And maybe I can ask the father to take a look at them? To be honest, I don't know how this sort of thing fits into my beliefs. I want to ask about it. Yeah, this is going to be a great weekend. Take the fucking little creep on tour. Ben, Allie, don't tell Joan I said this, but she's a fucking psychopath. Isn't she standing right there? <laughs> a doll. They were calling him Ben. Hope I don't have to remember their names. A doll. This one seems to be Allie. There's nothing interesting about it. Empty bins look almost good as new, if not a bit dusty. Nothing interesting about it. It's jammed. Oh. Wait, let me go back in. Wait, what? Oh no! <laughs> I didn't mean to leave! Ah, oh, heck. Damn it. I just wanted to see if it was gonna be like, oh, I can't go back, I must go forward, or something like that, but, uh... 
Might as well save again. School Wing West Hall. What is that? A painting of a moon with an eye that floats in a dark, sky dark starry sky. It's rather familiar. I don't like that. The door is sealed shut. There's a star design on the door with some text engraved onto it. When the stars are aligned. Okay. Who was that? There's a note plastered on the wall. Read it. Read it. My dear sweet little marshmallow, I watch you, my gaze fixed on your alluring form. You're always just out of reach, so close that my fingertips begin to tingle. Why do you tease me so, little marshmallow? Do you like to torture me? I like that. You know, back then I didn't know you yet. I had toyed around a bit in the past, sure. I even believed I knew what love was, but I never expected to be graced with someone as beautiful as you. You made everyone else so insignificant. You're my ideal, and I don't want you to forget it. Don't ever think for even a moment that you're unloved. I'm excited for what's to come. Sincerely yours, Simon. Simon, you're a fucking creep. Did you know that? The name on the cover. Tome of the Crimson Angel. Bookmark passage. Yeah, sure. And on this day, give us our daily blessing. Hmm. <clears throat> on. Ugh. We salivate for your morsels of sacrilege. No food or wine fills us to the brim like your treats. We plead to your holiness, more, more, and you grace us, spoiling us. You fill our bellies with warmth. We suckle and we rest, fulfilled and with hope. We sleep, excitedly waiting for tomorrow's blessing. That's, uh, creepy. Was that thing the Crimson Angel? It sure was crimson. Some shoot lockers. Where am I exactly? I'm pretty sure you're in a school. Probably gonna say the same thing, but okay. It's stuck. The clock has stopped moving. Let's check out these doors. Oh. A note is pinned to the wall. Sorry, the bathrooms are temporarily closed. We received reports of noises behind the walls and a foul stench coming from the restrooms. We suspect it may be due to a rat or roach infestation and ask you please don't use the bathrooms at this time. We'll get on to cleaning and reopening the restrooms soon. That's like exactly the same note that was in uh, the other game. It's the same restrooms that were in the other game. I can even flush all of them. Why is there a freaking... Oh, that seems to not be working. Why is there a freaking steam vent here? There's a stack of coal and steam coming out of a hole in this restroom stall. Let's, let's investigate it. Excuse me? Hey there! Oh? Oh? You are so pretty. Hey! Okay? I see why he likes you. Look. Look at it. At what exactly? Can I leave? Look at you? Look at this red wall. Can I, uh, can I leave? The door to the cell is unfortunately locked. It's a rose, but why? Oh? You're a murderer, I'm sure you're aware. But that does not matter now. Do you ever feel your spine bend back? Let me tell you a story. Not my story, but one I shall share. 
Once there was a young girl, such a sweet thing she was. She played and had fun with limitless amounts of energy and creativity. She was a smart and real kind. She was smart and real kind. You'd think everyone would have admired her. But everyone secretly loathed her. She was so sweet and precious, a bright and shining glow that cast a thick line of shadows on those around her, revealing their ugliness. Their shadow stirred and drove them to want to soil such a precious, sweet light. They committed atrocities to her. Hands reached out to grab her, to bruise her, to feel at her, to feel all over her. They thrust themselves onto her again and again. She screamed, and this made them very happy. The poor sweet girl screamed, and she screamed, but no one came to help. The truth is, they all wanted to see her suffer. One by one, they came to watch, and they all laughed. The girl's will and innocence whittled away. She deep down prayed for the forgiveness of her countless friends and peers, even as they spat on and defiled her. Even in this moment, her kindness showed through, making them want to hurt her more. Would you have laughed with them? Were you even aware? Maybe it has nothing to do with you. But what if it does? What does that make you? How can you be so certain that this wasn't you? That this had nothing to do with you? Why you might even... I might, I might even what? What, what, what might me might even? This is not the pure field. I'm sure you realize that by now. Right-click this game from your library, go to Properties, click the Local Files tab, and then Browse Local Files. Okay, hold on. You shall find the pure field there. Okay, let me, um... What happens if I resume from here? Okay, wait, I'm gonna do what it told me to just now. Let me... Okay, this is what I'm looking at. Right click. Brow browse local files. Yeah, cause this one's supposed to be the pure field, but it was called Feast Your Eyes. Game five. This is torture. The pure field. Just let that load. Mm -hmm. Ah, it crashed. Oh, oh, no, wait, it came back, it came back. Game capture. Wait, what? No, 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 heck. Here we go. Recollect. It's nice every once in a while to just relax from the stresses of life. Yeah. Take a moment, just a moment, and go outside, feel the sun, breathe in a breath of fresh air, and recall fonder times. <laughs> Treat yourself to a little of each day with some relaxation, and don't overwhelm yourself. A horror game developer? Find a red circle, a yellow triangle, and a red square. Or, no. Just make sure that you enjoy this moment, or you never know what the next one might bring. 
Okay. Oh. Wait, can I? Ah. Uh. Uh, hold on, hold on a second there, Pastor. Let me, um, find my mouse. Okay, let me plug in that mouse. Boop -a -doop. Uh, hello there. Do you have something to say? Okay, I guess you're just, uh, you know, you're just hanging out. You just keep hanging out over there. Hey there, pal. You, you dancing? You posing? All right. Wait, am I hitting the right button to interact on? I don't know how to interact with things. H hello. Oh, oh, most perplexing. Curiously, this gate is most often locked, you ridiculous gaijin. But sometime last night, someone or something disturbed and opened it. It's not like I want to know uh, or who might have opened it, Baka. Yeah, like, if I get right up on it, can I... Oh, there you go. How's it going down there? What am I up to? Trying to get closer to God. So far, it's not working, but I just gotta believe. Alright, you, you keep believing, buddy. Hey, what are you doing, pal? I found out how to direct. Yo, bro, I got some sun. Hi, three. Oh, he does only have... Three fingers. Okay. These are the same trees that were in the other game. Oh, uh, hello. What are what are you doing? Eek! Don't look at me. Though I guess this is my own fault. When everyone else was sleeping, I kind of enjoyed just taking off all my clothes and walking around. And then one night, the wind got strong and blew my clothes away. I guess I'm just gonna have to be naked from now on. But I haven't gathered up the courage to face the others yet. The the ridiculous boobs and butt posts. Okay. Uh, I hope one day you find the courage to just be naked. Like, like you want to be. Uh, hello? Yo, man, how's it hanging? You know, I'm just a normal guy, but us normal guys have feelings too. So I feel for you, and I hope you're doing better. Cool, I, I don't... Was, was I uh, not doing so well? Oh, look how cute this is. Hello? Ahahaha, ah, ah, finally I have obtained it! Ice cream! It's finally mine! I'm, I'm so happy that you finally obtained ice cream. Congratulations. Hello. Mwah 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 hey, mwah mwah! Cool. It's the same table. Okay, I guess I gotta go around here now. Hey, hey, hey there. Yeah, hey there, pal. Well, listen, buddy. I, I know you're curious, and you, and you think this must be the way forward. Like, yeah, you gotta do this to, like, uh, progress or some, some shit. But you, you don't gotta do anything. You should, you should take care of yourself, bud. I don't, I don't think going for it's the way. I just think this isn't what's best for you, you buddy. All right, pal. Um, pl please loosen your waist. You look like you're gonna. You look like you cut off all the circulation to your beer gut. Please, I'm, I'm concerned. Yep. Uh, yep. Uh. Oh, uh, what? That? Ah. Alright, be careful, buddy. Drink responsibly, okay? Okay. Guess that's just where it does that. Can I read this? What you are about to do, there's no turning back from. Once you leave, you're no longer welcome here. Make sure this is what you want, because it, it isn't, because it isn't, and yet you're doing it anyway. Well, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just playing a weird little game. So 
little autumn leaves falling from the sky. Did I get turned around? I did get turned around. this can't interact with any of these clusters okay there's a wall here like press myself into the wall until I find out where a door is. What am I supposed to be looking for? Oh golly, I just don't know where to go. Huh? There's a wall there. Can't interact with anything. Hello? Just sort of walking forward while pressing myself into the wall, see if I could find another one of those spots. Because I was like in a little space and I tried to hit the interact but I couldn't. Are things changing? I'm supposed to try to follow those noises? Uh, did I go all the way around? There's like a little... There's a wall here. There is in fact a wall here. Oh! Hey! Can I talk to you? My friend, struggle and rubble. Oh boy, what are those? What are those? Are those arms? Is it coming after me? Should I avoid the arms? I feel like I, maybe I should avoid the arms. That's, that's an arm. It looks like the arm that was coming down from the moon in Cootie Patootie. Pardon me, I just wanted to see if there's anything inside of here. Looks like there's nothing inside of here. Ok, 
Okay, so I'm probably looking for... So what is that? Ah. Oh, it's loading something. Is this the pure feel? I'm just gonna sort of choose a gate. Walk along it. Okay, I found another corner. Well, this is making me way more apprehensive than chilled out. Oh my god, it just keeps going. Because it's just really long in this direction. I'm betting the thing I'm supposed to find is somewhere in the middle. Maybe if I, uh... If I sort of get an idea of where the middle is over here... I still see that from here. And I lost sight of it. Is it a square, or is it a rectangle? I feel like each wall is getting longer the more I follow it. Okay, here's the other corner. Maybe if I start from the corner and do my best to go right, like, as diagonally as possible. Wait, is this... This isn't a 90 degree angle, is it? Is it a 90 degree angle? Okay, I think it is. Okay, so... It's hard to tell. Is this a gate? It's like, it's like detached, so it looks like a gate, but I guess it's not. Okay, um... There's, like, no way to tell whether I'm going... You know what? We're going. We're going forward. Okay, I'm, in fact, going forward. I'm gonna go toward that star. I'm going forward. It's really hard to tell that I'm going forward when nothing... is, like, visible. Like, nothing's moving. I know I'm moving. I think. Ah! A house loaded. Is it, like, right in the middle? Tanks? Plants? More tanks? It's a cafe. Hey 
there. This looks like a convenience store instead of a cafe, but... This is the convenience store. Hey there. The world was abandoned long ago. There's nothing beyond the cottage you knew, that's the truth of it. A lazy developer, a delayed game, an unfinished project, product, that's all the world is. You came all this way for nothing. A pure field is a boring one. For there to be purity, there must be nothing, for everything is drenched in sin. Still, the pure field is abandoned. You're just within its carcass right now. Be upset, make noise, scratch and flick, cause pain. If we're even a slight bit wrong, the other deserves it tenfold, isn't that right? Don't we live in an era of condemning, guilty until proven innocent, and even then, if it fits into your biases and view of the world, you'll accept what's not even true. Game 5 is a bust, and deep down, we all know it. Are you satisfied? Ah! Recollect, remember, up. Ah. It's nice every once in a while to take a moment, just a moment, and go outside and treat yourself around the fire, or just make sure... Uh, I'm, I'm back here. I feel like there's gotta be something else, right? Hey there, buddy. Oh, yeah. Accidentally clicked on him. Okay, so he just automatically stops you. It's okay, pal. T take care of yourself, man, you know? Here I have to find the red-eyed thing. Which was in a little area. To the wall. There you are. There's somewhere else I can go over here. Hello there, please. Please do not bother me. I will not bother you. hand waving hello how nice can I interact with the hands can I talk to the hands they don't seem to be after me hello is it a glove or is it ripped off I can't tell okay I can't talk to the hands I think the hands are harmless. Okay, well now from here I'm gonna... Okay, if I go straight out... Kind of hard to tell if I'm going straight out, so I go straight out. I should find the cafe again, right? That's actually a gas station. Okay. Should pop into view eventually. There you are. I wonder if there's anything else in this field? I'm not going to talk to the cashier yet. What is this? Hmm. I'll go into 
the back. Can't go into the back. Lock is broken. Ah. Uh. That was from the other game. Well, a lot of the stuff is from the other games, but... Hey there. I use this. Okay, what if I, um, at the menu it had, like, three different options. Take a moment, just a moment, and go outside, feel the sun, treat yourself around I wanted to see what recondition means. Well, let me, let me go back. F5? tab um there was another thing in here called this is torture got one more i'm gonna close hey stop that okay uh close that Open the pure field again. What's recondition? Oh, okay, this just has this information in it. Okay. Okay, close that. I'm gonna play the other one in this file called This Is Torture. I don't know what this is, but apparently it's torture, so let's check that out. Try to change the capture for it. If it will let me. May I please change the properties for game capture? Yeah, the pure field is now closed. Come on. Um. Come on, what's wrong? What is wrong? All of Streamlabs is frozen up, hold on. Okay then, I'll just have to open this. 
because this literally will not let me capture the game. Okay, this is called This is Torture. Read. I want to see the beauty you and your true self withhold. You're gonna hate this. You're going to suffer over and over again. Each time though each time through will wear on your on you, ruin you, and numb you. You'll then be of no use to me. You're disposable. I already know your beauty will never live up to hers, but I implore you to at least try to be a bit pretty. I'll be watching. You'll be seen. So please give me something pleasant to look at. Hmm. Can I go down? Hey there, pal. They be at hand, ma'am, with stick and fiddle. But since you think an easy thing to mount above the moon... Take a spring of your own fiddle, dancing at what thou's done. Alright then. I have the same weird walk cycle. Sing or run, bitch! Am I- Ah! It's, it stopped. Is that what happened to, uh... The girl from the, um... The girl from the gas station? Cause that- that kinda looked like her. Well, let's try the next game. Getting more messed up as I go along. Okay, hold on, nothing is. Come on. Uh. Hold on. Is that somehow interfering with this? Is it Streamlabs? Are you okay, Streamlabs? Okay. You gonna work with me now? Game stream, there we go. It started freaking out for a second. Huh. Okay. Steam. Play. Game 6, The Ominous Whisperer. Game capture. The ominous whisperer. Come on. All right. Let's see if my computer keeps freaking out. Do you ever feel like what you make is complete garbage? You want to do something. You desperately do. But... You have the passion, but you're your own worst enemy. Sometimes, depends During on the project. The of this game, one of my closest friends in the world no. died by suicide. This isn't a fictional story. It's the reality of my situation. Aww. This project is going to change as a result. I was playing a character earlier, an egocentric dev in the openings of my first few games. I had an idea to eventually antagonize myself as the games went on. To play on the idea of the image of a developer and how much you can actually know by playing their games, and probably because a part of me hates myself. Mm -hmm. I had a really bad dream the day before I recorded this about my deceased friend. And then I woke up. One of the biggest YouTubers had chosen to play my game. Oh, damn. And they hated it. Oh. <laughs> and it attracted good and bad, and me in an already grieving state. It's. It's like an ego death. I fucking bet. What the hell? I think games have the potential Who to be played harder it? than they are. That was always the point behind this game. It's crudeness and me narrating it. This is game four. Find the shapes. I hope you guys like it. Okay. Oh. 
Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, if I click on something. I'm not going to answer you. Why do you not feel oh, safe? Whoops. I don't know who the fuck you are. You know what? I do feel safe. Oh, so comfortable. I love horror games. Aww. Bitch, I don't know you. But you know what? You know what? Fuck it, we're friends now. Oh, that's so nice. I'm not sure about this. I don't understand. I can't think straight. Me either. I just want... Oh! Oh, I am so very cute! Lights fixated here for when it becomes too dark. Can't climb any higher than here. Oh, I, I can climb up those? I can't see very well through the windows. Oh, look, I'm just such a short little meow meow. A potted bush. I seem to be well taken care of. The hedges are well trimmed. Does this go somewhere? Can I climb up this? Oh ho 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 ho! The window appears to be open. Enter the house through the winter window? Let me see if I can get through the door first. Am I breaking in here? Knock? No one answers. Front door is locked tight. Okay, well, I guess I'll leave me no choice. I gotta break in. Oh, his letter. His letter is still sealed shut. Open it. Open it. Read the letter. Listen, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to push you like that. I understand if you never wish to speak to me again. I'll leave that up to you. But do know that I appreciate you, though. I really hope you know that. I need some time to figure stuff out, so I might not see you for a while. Hope you're doing well. Take care of yourself, though, please. Let's go into this house. See him again. Is that a save point? It is a save point. A lamp that's functioning correctly. A tucked in but messy bed. There's nothing in the desk. An open envelope with a written letter lays on the table. Let's read the letter, why not? We already broke it, I mean. I thank you for checking in with me and frankly I'm not okay right now, but I guess I'm managing. I'll tell you one thing though, it's boring here. Boring, boring, boring. I think I should I think I should think up something to do or else this place may drive me mad. But my health is fine and things aren't getting worse, so I guess overall I'm okay. Maybe by the time you get this things may even be a little bit better. Cheers. It seems like you never sent this letter. A cute little cushion. A healthy looking plant. No, oh, accidentally. Tap the thing. A teapot and teacup. Both are empty. An empty, clean plate. I don't think anyone's eaten off it since it was last washed. A chair sits beside a plate on the table. I wonder if he eats here? Is that like a little, little lunch tray? A little bento or something? What is that? I can't see it from here. A lamp that's functioning correctly. It's a painting of a large city of stone buildings lit up by festivities under a gorgeous cloudy night sky. Gorgeous cloudy nighty sky. It's a bird cage, but no bird. There were birdless bird cages in the other room too. Is that the front door? Wait, the front door was on the other side, wasn't it? The yellow door is locked. Small potted plant. Large potted plant. I like it when every single single thing in a game has like a description. Drawers full of empty, not important looking papers. A lamp that's functioning correctly. 
It's a glass table. I don't see a speck of dust on it. This chair looks like it's been cleaned recently. This chair looks very pristine. Okay, so everything in this house is, like, weirdly very clean. Are those, like, the... Oh, they don't look quite the same, but they're kind of like the big doors that I went through in the other game. It's a clock, a fake plant, and some drawers, which appear to be empty. Is this whole house just for show? Some empty drawers, not dusty, though. Oh. It's painting of some dark factory springing up from a barren forest wasteland. The sun looks huge. Can't go into that room with the green door. Or is that blue? The blue door is locked. Okay, but the yellow door and the blue doors are locked. What is- what are, are these doors? The iron door is locked. Let's- let's go downstairs! Wow, this place is fancy. The plant seems to be very well tended to. It's a strange clockwork device, I don't quite get it. It's a painting of some stairs leading up to some altar-looking place. The artistic door is locked. It's a painting of some cave where people are huddled to warm up by a fire. It's some flowers, they're rather pretty. It's a cabinet. Inside of it you spot a key, obtained the orange key. It's an oven for cooking food. It's a clean sink. Some kitchen drawers, nothing of interest I can see. This music. Some small palm tree looking plants. A lit candle helps make the room glow. Everything around here is kept pretty clean and tidy. A little stool. A wooden table. The plant looks nice and healthy. Its li its leaves its leaves reach out in every which direction. Is this door like purple? The purple door is locked. Okay, so I just obtained orange key. This looks like an orange door. Open the door with the orange key. A very well kept Asian style tree. It's really tiny. A little bonsai. A stack of some thin logs. Those are pretty thin logs. Some fairly strange, but still pretty flowers. They smell nice. It's a locked cabinet. A pretty nice yellow kimono. A maroon lamp. There's some pretty nice chairs he's got. Is this a bucket? An urn? I'm not quite sure. It's a small and bright kimono. It's a mat laid out with bowls of vegetables placed onto it. It's a creepy red limbless mannequin. A kimono with pink and red design is hung up to be presented. A strange circular cushion. Some barrels sealed up tight. A large idol of some sort. I think this one is from Buddhist beliefs, but I'm not well versed in deities or anything. It's a fire pit. It still looks like it's in good condition. A large idol of some sort, but I'm not well versed in deities or anything. A stack of some fancy barrels. The drawer is open, but mostly empty, except for one parcel of paper. It reads L9U3R1U7R1U3L3U5. Well, okay. Did I take it? Okay, am I gonna have to write that down? <laughs> You'd think I would have a pen in reach. Okay, hold on. I feel like I should write that down just in case. Oof. Oh, I hate it when I'm sitting on my leg weird and I don't realize it until I try to stand on the leg. 
Okay. Okay. L nine. U three. R one. Is that like left nine up three right one? Huh. U seven. R one. U three. L three. U five. So I'm guessing L U R. Uh, L U R and that is like left up right. From here, do I have to go? Wait, would I be able to do that from? Okay, hold on. Yeah, L nine U three R one U seven R one U three L three U five. So, okay, left nine. Starting from where though? Because I can't go left nine from here. Way back in comfortable looking chair. I gotta find a place where I can do that. It's a fire pit. Still looks like it's in good condition. Because like I can't go. It starts with L, and I can't go left nine spaces from here because there's not enough space to go nine spaces. Maybe it's from one of the doors? Maybe there's going to be a big puzzle room where that'll be useful? The shoji door is locked. Maybe it's from here? But then I, and then I end up here. And I can't go up three. Is it all the way from the side? Maybe it's here. Can't go seven there. Hey there! How about you fuck off? Um, I don't want to deal with you right now. Can I run? I can run. Boy, do I not like the noises that thing is making. Did I do it right? Fuck! Is it gonna follow me? Okay, now. Um. I don't know if that was supposed to happen, or if that happened because I did that, or what? Am I supposed to do that from here? Uh. About this door. Oh yeah, okay, that was the artistic door. It's locked. Um, I still only have his letter. Mm -mm. Am I supposed to go back down in here? Ah! Put me back in the beginning. Probably because of that little thing that was chasing me. That's not a waste of time if I enjoy it. Stop overthinking and focus. Easy for you to say.
I can't examine anything. Okay, I can go through the doors and stuff though. Where's the area where I'm supposed to do all this though? Maybe it's down here somewhere? If I go back in here, will it kill me immediately? Okay. Probably it sure is dark in here now. Is the Shoji door open now? Oh, it is. Oh man, why can't I examine things? Is it because it's too dark? Maybe it, uh, I, I guess the thing says that filling my head with unwanted distractions is bad, so it doesn't want me examining everything. But I want to examine everything. I like examining everything. What is it? What's over here, then? Is that a wall? I guess that's a wall. door somewhere here? Is there... a key? Inside the chest you saw something useful. Obtain the blue key. Alright, found the blue key. Look at all the stuff I could be examining. But no. God, this is such a what? drag. Huh? The light is red now. Go to the blue door. Open the door with the blue key. Let's hop in here then. Oh. Dang it. I still gotta check everything to see if there's a key in here. Oh, there's someone in here. Hello. Don't mean to creep up on you, but hi. I thought you might come around eventually. You know that breaking and entering is a crime, don't you? It's okay, though. You can do what you want. No, this matters anyway. Everything about this is just terrible. I don't even know why you keep coming back. Am I seeming cruel to you? Well, there's a good reason. You're stupid for thinking anyone really cared. No, I'm not. Shut up. Put up with you. Do you think you're a good person? No. So I guess you're just gonna give in and complain. Good people don't call themselves good people. Why do you need so much validation just to feel good about yourself? Because I'm human and we need validation? God. Shut up, intrusive thoughts. Oh, I know who you are. You're the depression. You'll keep on hurting them. You don't deserve to be happy. Shut up, depression and anxiety. Your points are tired. You boring.
this is our top two. Okay, I can't find any other keys in here. Looks like I gotta go back out here. It's full of bird cages now. The, the painting is gone. Oh, what's this? There's a note with a key placed on the table. The note reads, I'm sorry for bailing on you. Come find me in my study. I'll be waiting for you. Let's take the key, the artistic key. Head on downstairs. Huh. This changed. What is this? Pipes? There's scales over here. Open the door with the artistic key. They've collected. I have lost almost all of my homely possessions. This house no longer feels like a home. A barren set of rooms that mockingly resemble a home. Yet thankfully, they haven't found my greatest secret. They think they've stripped me bare, taken my power, and have me right where they want me. The fools, they have simply aided me in ascending to greater heights than they could have ever comprehended. Now there's nothing left I care for to hold me back from unleashing my little secrets onto this world. With my loss, I shall inflict upon this world a new perspective, one where humanity are not the kings, but the peasants. Interesting. Okay, so a little villain monologue there. A set of books on various objects. It looks like some of the books were taken off the shelf recently. Hmm. A drawer. It's completely empty inside. I look pretty tired. I don't know how that is. The sounds are growing restless beneath the floorboards. I have taken to writing my thoughts down, maybe in the hopes that someday someone may read them. I do not believe I have much time left for this world. When they took everything from me, I was almost overcome with a sense of relief. Quite possibly a sense of validation, justifying my secrets as having been worthwhile. But thankfully I sat on it for a few days before acting, and in reflection, I am now less certain if this is truly for the best. My intentions are far from pure, and my emotional side is soured on the mere image of humanity. But my rational side can't help but fight for what logically makes sense. And no matter how I figure it, every outcome points to me being a madman. But am I truly mad, or am I simply stumbling into a world of unperceived genius that would change the very morale held to this species? Oh, okay then, Joker. Only ask you how you got your scars there. Oh, we got a badass here. Regardless, I still sit on it and think. I should continue writing in these journals. It helps me reflect on my thoughts. And I must make sure those things stay sealed underneath this house for the moment. But how- but can no one else hear the howls? Oh, wow, you're so crazy. You're a mad genius. Oh. The Sounds of the Beast, Chapter 1. Many of the pages are ripped out, but this verse remains. The moon and the sun were pulled by great oxen, a beautiful and graceful silver ox for the moon, and a powerful and majestic golden ox for the sun. They were observed by the great guardian bear and its lingering shadow. The silver ox went first, singing a beautiful melody from the stars to the cosmos to wane the light given off by the golden ox. The guardian bear gave a grunt in response to express its joy as the shadow began to disperse itself across the land. The shadow stayed silent, quietly watching the world it consumed, basking darkness for all life to turn in and slumber. But with the shadow's darkness came a chill as the world began to freeze. The guardian bear then growled twice to inform the silver ox of the growing coldness. The silver ox lowered its head in silence and retreated to the den of gods. The golden ox awoke and spread its light, overpowering the shadow of the night with a mighty bellow. 
the, sou the, ah, the shadow left out a single shriek as it retreated under the protection of the guardian bear. The rest of it is torn out. Is that going to be necessary to some puzzle? What's this? The door appears to lead outside, but it's locked. Hmm. There's a beautiful cross situated here. There's a switch and a plaque inscribed into it. When the beast howls are heard and the cycle is complete, then the passage shall open. Okay. There's a switch and plate underneath the mounted animal head. The plate reads Silver Ox. Golden off, not yet. Okay, so I have to follow the directions on the thing. There's a switch and plate in the mountain. I'll head Guardian Bear. The Shadow. Okay, well, let me read that again to make sure. All of the drawers are empty. Make sure I get that. It's like a... Okay, then the sun folk are oxen. Okay, so silver guardian silver guardian shadow guardian guardian golden? Is like the silver ox, and then wait, is it silver shadow guardian gold? Yeah, like grunt, so. Okay, so let's try it, yeah, like, silver... Eh. Silver Guardian. Shadow. Two from the Guardian, because it said it growled twice. And then Golden, right? Okay. Okay, so silver shadow guardian. If it's not this one, then maybe it's the guardian twice. Also incorrect. Okay, hold on. Silver Ox stayed silent, so I guess it doesn't use that one at all. Okay, 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 hold on, it's when they make the frickin' noises, duh. Okay. So, silver, and then the guardian bear is like, cut it out twice, and then the golden ox wakes up and bellows, and then the shadow shrieks and hides under the guardian. Is that it? Okay, so let's try again, but without... I think three for the Guardian? One, two, three, and then... Because it says it grunted and then it growled twice. While the shadow stayed silent. Wait, 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 fuck, I did that wrong. I was supposed to... 
No, wait, 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 wait. I think I think I did that okay. It's okay, it's okay. And then the shadow shrieks, right? Okay. There we go, okay. A new passage appeared. Oh dang. Hold on, I didn't go over here. I thought uh, I thought it was gonna open this door. Oh what the hell? I like how I can run in this one. You can see stairs leading down to darkness. Uh, not yet. There's a switch on it. Not yet. Okay, there's gotta be another book or something around here that says what to do, right? Is that like a little podium there, or is that one of the switches? Okay, maybe it's up at the top. Try to run around, get a little faster. Maybe I need some help for this room, because I don't know what to do in there. Hmm. An oil drum, it's full. Oh, I can burn this place down. Pipes line the walls. A fixated light. Some sort of boiler, I think. Stack of barrels. Oh, is that one spilling? This oil drum has fallen and spilled over. That's not good. Oh, a save point. one first. Uh oh. I have no idea what this is. I have to keep the fires burning and the electricity running. They mostly stay out of the light. It's not as if they're weak to it. I just think they're so used to the darkness that it hurts their eyes when adjusting to sudden brightness. Still, they've shown to have a one-track mind and will dismiss any blinding lights when they could become excited by the hunt. I've seen that nothing will stop them when they're greedily eyeing their prey. Hmm. Oof. Strange device, I have no idea what it does. Okay, so there's some kind of things out here that, uh, live in the darkness, that's nice. I am in a dark place. I almost never venture to the upper floors of the house anymore. It reminds me too much of that which I've lost. As sad as it may sound, this dimly lit and unknown dungeon feels far more like a home to me. At least in this domain, I reign as a king. And I may spend the rest of my days with my beloved children. Children. to make sure. It's a bookshelf, but it's too dark to see. Hmm. Some sort of hidden way through there. Might as well. Hello? It's a skeleton in a cage. Well, isn't that nice? I go back? Okay, I can't see a damn thing. Is there a flashlight down here? A candle? The door's jammed.
Is this where I'm supposed to use the... Okay, I can't even go nine paces there. Uh... Okay, yeah, that's the door. What happens if I go straight up? Found another door. Oh, this is bright. Fuck is that? What is this? Beware if a foul child spots you, they won't forget. Somehow they communicate with each other, even over a great distance. I'm not sure if they can accomplish this with their disgruntled moans, some unknown sixth sense, or even telepathy. But once one has spotted you, the hunt is on. Never perceive yourself as safe. Book line- book shelf lined with books on forensics, mythology... Please go away. Ugh, ugh, could you not make that noise, please? Get in the door! Not a fan of that sound. Excuse you. Why are you coming down here? God. No, fuck off. Uh, uh. Can I turn the... What is M-E? I don't know. Continue, please. Okay. Let's check the store. Oh yeah, the store's jammed. This goes into the dark area. There's some way I can get a light. Where's the... Wait, the, the door over here is gone. Lovely. Is it? It's gone. Guess I gotta go through this area. It is 6pm, so maybe I'll leave this for my future self. Okay, yeah. Gotta sign, off, uh, gotta sign off for now, I gotta go work on some stuff, gotta uh, drink some more water, does it feel like I have a migraine coming on? Okay, not due to this game, due to some other stuff. I'm really enjoying this, but yeah, I gotta end this for now and come back to it tomorrow. Goodbye.